Happy Sunday. Just a quick little hello. Still peaceful, still grateful, still serene. There's every reason for it and no reason for it. I mean, I, I mean, there's only really every reason for it. If I can sit out of, if I can step out of the what and the who and the think and the, the compare and despair self, the egoic self that's imperative to exist in because it sets me apart from you, but the trap that I fall into is the compare and despair, the what do I truly want? And not in reflection to what I think you want I want or what I'm told or taught to want or collectively taught I should have, I need, consume, all that stuff. That's why I think when you extricate yourself from all of the nonsense, whether it's a silent retreat or, you know, a, a vacation where you unplug, so to speak, we begin to, as individuals, hear the call of our truth. And then when we get back in to the matrix or society, it gets really difficult to hear that again. So to do that while you're still amongst the chaos is extremely challenging. Seeking to find peace within this chaos, challenging. take a second or not take a little bit more than a second take a few minutes to just get grounded in yourself <sighs> breathe because for me if I don't connect with that the chaos will sweep me up my mind will take me on on a ride and I will have not left where I'm sitting. Just take me someplace else. Worry, fantasy, maybe worrying within the fantasy. And that's not to say that I can't, you can't plan and envision through the, using fantasy to create what you want. I think that's the, the good part. But when you just disasterize, that's bowing down and praying and creating the worst thing for yourself. Anyway, babbling. Happy Sunday. Big light. Much love. Peace.